Hi guys, today I got uh, Grand Prime Pro G532F uh, with FRP look on. This uh, phone with the G532G are uh, MTK based CPU, and uh, they are they are they have many problems uh, related to dead boot because any mistake will make the device uh, dead. Uh, the most successful device for remo removing FRP that I tried and uh, experienced was uh, the Chimera tool. So connect the phone in download mode as I did. As you see here, FRP look on. G532F. Now I will launch the Chimera tool. As you see, camera mobile phone utility. Since phone it is connected in download mode, the camera will detect it automatically. Now go to FRP screen look, go to reset FRP look, and uh, look for the model, for the exact model to remove FRP for, from it. When you press, press the second FRP method press next we will look for G532 unfortunately it's not here we will press back we will go now to the new FRP look method press next now look for the model okay I found the model G532 F G532 F XXU you win the most important thing to avoid the death of the phone is the binary. Okay? The binary is the most important thing. How we can check it? We will uh, make the phone report by the buttons to the recovery mode. I will stop the video. As you see guys, I rebooted the phone to the recovery mode via buttons the volume up, uh, home buttons and the power buttons here is the android icons I will wait uh, until the recovery options uh, show up we will check from there which, which uh, firmware we have on the phone and we will uh... okay as you see here is the firmware G G five thirty two F X W U one. Okay, now we will power off the phone and proceed to the download mode. Now I will connect the phone to the PC. As you see, the camera tool detected. We will go to the FRP screen look uh, tab. Next, then we will select the model. As advice from me as A user uh, take photo of the firmware on the phone you have in case any problem happened you can flash the phone with the firmware on it here is the uh, G532 as we see uh, we saw sorry you won the same binary now we will press start here is the most important thing Okay, the camera tools shows the a pop-up window asks for the binary numbers on the phone in download mode. We will go to the download mode and check the numbers of the binary. So it will flash the correct boot. As you see, those are the numbers. When
zero zero. So we will um, input them. One zero. Sorry. One zero zero. And press OK. Now the phone rebooted. Okay, we will wait and check if the look was remote, removed successfully or not. As you see, the camera wait for the phone to be the ADB, ADB mode enabled. We will check the dial bars from here. The MTP, the Samsung Mobile Composite Device, the ADB interface. We must be patient. The device uh, stuck on logo, so I uh, removed the battery and uh, put it again. I plugged in the battery again. The driver will be installed, reinstalled. As I told you, we must be patient. Now the Samsung logo appear and disappear, which means we are uh, on the correct uh, way. Just wait for the operation to finish. The device is still installing the driver. We will wait to the screen to pop up. As you see here, the device now is locked with a uh, pin code. We have to go to the recovery and make wipe data, wipe cache. I made the wipe data, wipe cache from recovery and I'm waiting for the phone to complete the reboot to the normal mode then uh, installing driver. We will wait uh, for the phone to complete uh, reboot to the complete reboot to the normal mode. And uh, as you see, the boot that was flashed by the camera tools uh, enabled the ADB. We'll press OK. Uh, as the operation took too long time, the first first method failed now we will press hide now we have another of rp tools via adb mode it is a reset of rp lock we will wait to the device to the fully boot so sorry for the long uh, op operation time but i want to explain it step by step the most important thing Flash stock firmware after the FRP remove. Why? You will face two two problems. The first problem: the charge will not exceed 80 percentage and will stick there. The second problem is the Wi-Fi will go will turn off and on. Now we'll press start.
as you see this is the account uh, it's asking for the account just make frp reset just give a uh, new it will ask you for the yes yes as you see the removal of the rp was done okay now go to the about phone from here enable usb debug mode and uh, in developer option go and enable oem unlock enable now 